what's up this is your boy XMOA Rampage here with a black light retribution gameplay playing some search and destroy basically the topic I'm going to talk about today is what I would like to see in the full version of this game like more stuff like if you don't know this game been out for PC about at least two years I think I might be wrong uh, things I would like to see in this game is more good because if you don't know this does say beta version but you basically still have all the guns in the full version if you don't know and i think we're missing a couple helmets and that's really it for the customization i know we're missing maps and game modes but basically the way free to play games stay alive is by adding more content like if they are not going to do anything with a full ps4 version come out i'm kind of scared that this game is going to die very quickly honestly because i'm level 44 already I already know people that's like 69 58 like where are they going to do to make them want to stay in this game if they're not going to add anything new it's going to be kind of hard for players to want to stay and i understand they can't just copy guns and then just throw them on here because with the customization i understand that but what they should do is get guns like the P90. You know how like on the P90 basically, uh, I'm calling the P90 by basically saying the uh, tactical SMG. You know how you can only change the barrel and the sight. You should add like two more guns like that that you can just steal the design, the looks from a gun, but then just get the same rate of fire, copy and paste from like the, like for example. You can put a gun like the MTAR on here, a SMG. Copy like the M7, rate of fire, different hip spread, aim spread, maybe a little bit longer range, and then bam, there you go. All you can really change is the barrel and the sight. And another gun I would like to see on this game is like a Desert Eagle. I don't know why, but that's, that used to be my favorite pistol on Call of Duty 4. The Desert Eagle, oh, the Go Desert Eagle, that was just my gun back in the day. But yeah, like, I don't see this game staying alive when it fully comes out, like, the full But yeah, I just can't see this game staying alive and, like, when the full game comes out in, like, two years. Because I'm hoping that they're not going to do the same thing with the PC version right now. Because they're annoying, the PC version. But the only reason I think they're doing that is because they're putting all their attention on the PS4 version. So hopefully when the PS4 version comes out completely, that they're going to start adding more content because I play on the PC a little bit here and there, not any good at it, but they just completely basically banned the PC version so far. So I'm hoping as soon as the whole game comes out for the PS4 that they start adding more content and I'm hoping they like do the same thing what they did for the new helmet on the PC version. They basically ask people what type of designs and they will pick the top 10 designs and stuff and then that's what they should do with guns and everything basically and maps anything let us basically do the design work and all you have to do is copy it and pin it on here make everybody happy that's what i would do if i had this company if i were to uh be able to run it that's just my opinion but also, that's why I love free-to-play games. They're not like Call of Duty or Battlefield. You don't know, you pay your 60 bucks up front and then you're screwed if the game is horrible. I look at Call of Duty and Battlefield. I was the biggest fan for Battlefield. I'm not even gonna lie. I was, I love Battlefield 3 and Bad Company 2. I thought Battlefield 4 was gonna be the best game. I mean, come on, it didn't even work the first week it came out. I know I said that in my other video, but I, I was just very pissed off about that. But, like, they, they basically have to earn your money. Like, they're not going to get any money from you. Like, if you don't like the game, you don't have to spend a dime. So basically, they're, they, if they want your money, you, they have to work for it, basically. That's why I really love with free to play games. And honestly, I think more companies should go free to play. That's just my opinion though, because they just, it's basically, they gotta work for your money. They don't just, oh, here's the next Call of Duty. I hope you like it. If you don't, screw you. Like, Call of Duty Ghost is a joke. Call of Duty to me is dying. Like, 
I think Blacklight Retribution is better than Call of Duty Ghost, hands down. Like, look at Call of Duty. Why well, got? I actually got Call of Duty, so you can't say, or oh, you're probably just a Battlefield fanboy. I I got Call of Duty. I play the game. When I play Call of Duty Ghost, I feel like I'm on my Xbox 360. Like, come on. The graphics is like ridiculous. And the whole, like you get killed with like three bullets. Call of Duty is like the smallest skill gap of every Call of Duty I've ever seen. I swear, every year, like they're taking health away. Every single year, in a couple more years, you could probably kill someone with one bullet in Call of Duty. Look what, I, I say it now. I bet you like Call of Duty 16 or 17, you gonna be able to one shot someone with a freaking pistol. I, I just see it because the way they're going right now is basically every year they're making it easier and easier so they could rise the fan base because anybody can get this game like you don't know how much I know a 14 year old that's basically MLG Pro in Call of Duty I know like a 6 year old that's pretty good at Call of Duty like Call of Duty now I know why they're so like big because it's so easy like Call of Duty is the easiest first-person shooters in games history like COD 4 no I can't talk about COD 4 I love COD 4 and Modern Warfare 2 but then I, I just don't know Call of Duty now I used to love it now I think while well, mature I just don't like it anymore because I see Call of Duty as a kid's game now like I know I'm about to get a lot of hate from this from all the Call of Duty fanboys, but I really don't care. Like, they can't hurt me, so yeah, screw them. Fuck them. But yeah, this is all I have for today. Hope you enjoyed the gameplay. But yeah, if you liked the video, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe. Thank you.